It was so exciting, John. You simply had to see it and be here to believe it. There hasn't been this much excitement in middle America since Dorothy left the farm to walk down the yellow brick road to see the wizard. Last night, though, the wizard was Michael Jackson, kicking off his American tour. Michael sang and danced and just generally brought the house down. Okay, where's Teamer? But before we get to that, we want to take you backstage for an exclusive visit to Michael's dressing room, where we had special access to a Jackson pre-concert tradition. We thank you, Father, that the eyes of the world are upon us and that your grace is with us and your mercy is always extended toward us. This quiet moment has become an integral and important part of Michael Jackson's solo tour as his band and backup singers crowd into his dressing room just minutes before going on stage. When we look to you for tonight's show. We thank you, Father, for the safety of everyone involved. In Jesus' name we pray. Besides the prayer, there's what the Jackson folks call the war hoop. Moments later, Michael is on his way to the stage and a sold-out Kemper Arena where 17,000 of the faithful are waiting. It's been four years since Michael Jackson has set foot on an American stage, but the months of preparation and the weeks of rehearsal in Florida immediately prove one thing, Michael Jackson is back. The huge crowd was treated to two hours of non-stop Michael Jackson. Songs, spins, jumps, costume changes, and most of all, dancing. He is, without a doubt, one of the premier entertainers of any generation. We're going to show you more of that exciting performance later on in the show. And John, I just have to tell you, it was nothing short of spectacular last night. This Jackson frenzy returns to sold-out Kemper Arena tonight, and then it's on to New York, St. Louis, and Indianapolis. But uh, I think even Andrew Lloyd Webber would have been on his feet applauding. <laughs> Well, Mary, since the hundreds of reporters are going to be asking you this question anyway, I might as well be the first. Mary Hart holding hands with Michael Jackson. Now, you want to tell us something? Well, it's a rare privilege to have been back backstage with him in his dressing room, needless to say. I mean, I think you could see how special it was. And he grabbed my hand, and I said, Michael, are you nervous? When I get nervous, my hands are cold and clammy. He was fine. I was more nervous, John, than Michael. <laughs> it looked great. Thanks, Mary. <laughs> 